Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome everybody to a new video and get ready to have your mind blown. We are playing Duris on BO3. Now you might be asking yourself, you're like, okay, hold on a second, chill out, chill out, chop. Like, what's going on here? The giant is already Duris on BO3. But no, but no, it's not. You know nothing. Look where we are. Guys, this is actually a more faithful remaster of Duris than the giant is. Um, all of the World at War, like, weapons, sound effects, everything there like that be has been implemented into this Peace. version of the game. So, like, literally, just look at the Pack-A-Punch. It's, it's, it it's somehow well looks protected. better for some That's reason. Um, I can't really put my finger on why. I think it's just better lighting, but... And you can hear the gun sounds as well. It's just so classic, man. It's so iconic. And also, if you guys want me to play through more remakes like this and, uh, you know, other maps that are kind of like a faithful remaster to one that you might know, then uh, leave a like on the video. I'd appreciate it. Subscribe also if you're new to the channel. Now, I'm pretty sure there's no gumballs on this map. Uh, I'm not positive, but I'm going to probably go by this door and check. I don't believe there's any gobble gum whatsoever. Like, they wanted to, as far as, like, gameplay is concerned, they wanted to keep it uh, as close as they can to the original, which I appreciate. So, yeah, look, no gumball machine at all. It is not there. The corner the corner is like blocked off, so it kind of looks like it's there. You know, I can't actually I can't back all the way into this corner, which is kind of weird. But uh yeah, there's no gumball machine. And all of like so check this out. This is a double barrel. The classic, dude. The absolute classic. So I think what I'm gonna do is we're gonna get pack a punch open, and I wanna upgrade the Colt. And see if it's the, the, uh, basically the original World at War version. You know what I mean? Because for those of you who have never played World at War, the upgraded 1911 is not actually the Mustang and Sally, but, uh, from that game. That changed a little bit in, like, the BO1 version and from then on, but the World at War upgraded pistol is actually a lot different. That some of you guys might not remember. All right, just a little more points here, and I think, I think I might go, uh, I was gonna say we could buy the Tommy gun, but it's, like, 1,200 points, and I think I'll just save what we have. Um, because I, I know the mystery box is coming up soon. So yeah, like this room even looks a lot different as well Um compared to the giant they're like similar, but this does certainly have a different atmosphere. Let me see the grenades Are these the same world at war? Oh, they are look at that Yo, we got the OG grenades. <laughs> I actually love it. That's so good gonna try to get as many points as physically possible because then Yeah, okay, we should be able to open up the door now and then Probably get power on at the same time. Maybe get a box hit. Let's see. Yeah, just a little short. Okay, there we go. Um, all right, if we get, like, Wonder Waff or something first. Well, oh, that's also double tap one. Look at that. I didn't realize. So, this is a pretty faithful remaster. Wow. This area looks pretty insane, too. Oh, my God. The entire lighting change. You see, you just get, like, way more saturated. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. You know what? Let's do it, though. Let's see what we get. I see all those classic guns in the box. Oh, we got, oh, okay. Wow. Um, streamer loot, by the way. No enemy can withstand such force. Wow, dude. What I really appreciate, look at this Wonder Waff model. It's not the one from BO3. It's actually like a custom one imported. It's, wow, it even sounds the same too. You Bro, this is, in, this is actually incredible. You don't realize how much like visuals and audio really make a difference when it comes down to it. That is unbelievable, man. Um, that's so good. So... The thing is, like, I, I don't know how many people are going to agree with me about remakes, but I really think that, you know, when... when Okay, Chronicles is, like, a good remaster of all the ones that they've done, but... And they include, like, all of the BO3 weapons into those maps, which is fine. You know, it's fair enough. But I also think that they're, like... There could be remasters done in a way where it is as true to the original as possible, sort of like what we're doing here, because it actually feels substantially different than the giant. You know, even though it's the same layout and same map, um, the the little details and the small changes that separate these two maps are just like, they, they can't be overstated. Okay, I'm gonna buy this door. Uh, let's go get, oh bro, that look, this room just looks better. You see what I'm saying? Oh my God, this looks really good. Hold on, this is like a thumbnail. This looks really good. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, well, let's go. Let's go link these up. Okay. This should be the first one. Number one. There we go. Easy clap. And we should be getting our bonus here as well, which we will need. I'm going to wait on that. What do you got for me? What do you got for me? Uh, let's see. Oh, nuke? That's, a, that's an interesting spawn sound. So as long as all these guys are in, I think I can just nuke it fine and that should end the round all right here we go so i'm interested if these dogs are I any different at all 
Let's uh, let's see here. Let's see what we're working with. Okay, they look like BO3 dogs. Let's just let's just try to get a. Oh my gosh! Hold on. Hold on, chill. <laughs> I I can't tell if they look any different. Oh god. Look, uh, honestly, look about the same to me. Ow. Please do not. Please do not. Please do not. Oh, boy. These ones are low-key a little bit dangerous. Okay, that'll do it. All right, with two waff shots to spare as well. So make sure uh, <laughs> make sure we get that fully loaded. Yeah, so here we go. Second teleporter. Wow, they just, they just look better, man. I don't know what to say. They just look more epic. So we're linked to the second one. I think the goal, what I have planned for this map, is I just want to upgrade as many guns as possible. Starting with, obviously, arguably the two coolest guns in the game already. The Cole upgraded and then the Wonder Wolf as soon as we can get uh, through the last door. But as soon as we got that, man, we're going to be we're gonna be in good hands. Okay, we've got double points. This is the time to really go in. Because i got to get through two doors pretty much right now. Should have enough, to be quite honest. I think this will do it. Um, just be... So watch ourselves here. It's so strange because it just feels a lot more like classic zombies map progression. Wow, this room actually looks great. What the heck? What have they done with the lighting in here? It looks insane. Um, so open this up. There's that beautiful looking teleporter. That's number three. So we'll hook this, hook this thing up. And in theory, that should allow us to get pack a punch probably by like next round. And I think I might upgrade my Colt first. Ooh, Ooh big max ammo. Thank you. Yo, we love that for you, dude. All right, and there it is. We will take those. Wow, it just just looks really damn good. Um, okay, let's get the last guys over here. I imagine because all these gun models are pretty much like you know they're the OGs. I I imagine this is gonna be the original Colt, and I'm really excited to to play with it again. Just probably buy quick revival while I'm at it, just to be safe. You know what I mean? Ain't gonna go for Jug yet. Cause we gotta we gotta go for pack a punch first. That's what a real gamer play is, but we'll get that we'll get those perks situated in a moment. We do have enough to upgrade, so you know what? You know what? We just gotta do it. We gotta do it. Oh crap, I forgot to Oh no. I was gonna upgrade my Colt first. Hey, whatever, whatever. Let's let's check it out. Okay, I'm pretty sure the model of this is like slightly mistextured. I mean the lights look really dang good on it, but I think it's supposed to be more of like a what, like a silver? I mean it looks okay, honestly. The question is, does it slap, though? I meant to do the Colt first, but I'm an absolute moron. So it's fine. If we get Jug now, um, we can go, like, I don't know. Maybe, it shouldn't take us too many more rounds just to get another 5k. But at least we have this kind of safety on deck. All right, double points. That should be it, gamers. This is going to be the round. So if the if we can get the Colt upgraded, then that should just, like, open the door for everything else we got to do. This is so good, man. Like, I actually feel like I'm, like, uh, like... In a, in a different way, I feel like I'm actually playing Doris. All right, now. Now we got enough for the Colt. I'm going to upgrade the right gun this time, guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. I got this. You know what? This is good, though. Okay. It's the moment of truth, guys. Will this be the right gun? The world is waiting. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. There it is, guys. Look. Dude, this is the, the og -est OG Colt upgrade. Before the Mustang and Sally... Who is that? Here it is. The C3000 Biatch. There it is, bro. <laughs> Look at that. Absolutely, absolutely insane. Now, to be honest, it's not... I don't know if it's as effective, you could say, but only downside to using this gun is, obviously, there's no PhD on uh, Duris, but also because there's no gumballs for, like, Danger Closest, this is always going to be uh, a pretty explosive option. So it's not ideal, like... But, you know, if you come up here fire a little bit it can still work it's fine but um but let's see we'll pack a bunch of this as well well do we go here yes the 420 impeller oh my god man it is good to be back it is good to be back because you really can't play you, like it's a sin if you play Doris and you don't get the ray gun at some point or another it's just not right there's a trench gun i'm gonna say no thank you to that one dude also it would be a sin to play Doris and not go to the catwalk. Guys, it's gotta it's gotta be done, man. It has to be done. Just this image alone just invokes such nostalgia. Like, oh my oh my god, man. This is this is what I this is truly what we live for as zombies players. This is why we do what we do. Ooh, it's actually gonna get kinda hectic up here. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, good thing we got the Wonder Wolf behind us. But yeah, it'd be it'd be a shame to play Doris and not camp. Okay, like I usually don't play this strat ever in in the Giant. You know, this is not what you do. You want to get high rounds. You you play out front. You play by pack punch. But to really live it up, it's got to be this. Also, we need speed cola. So let me let me go grab that real quick. Let's see what this perk icon looks like. Cause it's not gonna be the double tap 2.0. Oh wow, it's like a stylized version of it. You see? Oh my god! Wow, this is insane. You can tell it's not double tap 2.0. Like you, like your guns just start hitting different, and like it is kind of, but it's also just shooting faster. And I, I mean, granted, I am killing zombies faster as well, but like. You can tell it's not that double tap 2.0, which is fine, you know, which is just fine. Um, all right, send the round here. Actually, I mean, we got about 5,000. Maybe spin a little bit for that ray gun. Come on, be good to me. Be good to me. What do you got? No. All right, now let's go camp with our new and improved perks. And let's see if this is any different. This is like, this was like peak setup back in the day, though. Like, you would have this you know, set up of perks and guns or whatever, and you'd be like, wow, okay, now we're good to go. Now you just kill zombies. Wow, this is a lot less effective than I was hoping it was going to be. Um, I just died and had quick revive. Hello? I just died with quick revive? Okay, original D Doris has no quick revive, but why did I buy the perk and I still die? I don't know. That's strange. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one.